Hi, everybody. Uh, we are so lucky that we're here hanging out with all our, uh, a bunch of friends uh, at Keto Palooza. And I thought it'd be fun to kind of go around and just give one little piece of advice that we could use to improve our health. And mine is be nice to yourself. So I can go this way. You can end with me. Oh, clockwise. There you go. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> it means all the kids can be taken by the time. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We just <laughs> okay. At least I'm not lax. <laughs> Dr. Bird's gonna have to advise vegetables. <laughs> uh, okay. One thing. No one is the health expert on you except for you. If you are in pain. Find out why before just going to a pill or a something similar to a medication. Um, do something that makes you happy every day. I like it. I would just say never give up on yourself. You have to be your best advocate. I would say uh, go to therapy as often as possible. Good one. I'd say move your body. You're meant to move, and if you don't do it, things just go downhill from there. So they have new VR glasses <clears throat> that are meant to be worn. Well. I thought you were going to say they have new Find out what works for you because things that work for you may not work for other people. We get a lot of that in the keto community. People are like, hey, can, is this keto? Is that keto? If you're allergic to peanuts, peanuts aren't keto. If you can't do nightshades, jalapeno poppers are not keto for you either. So figure out what works for you and do keto your way. I would say remember that you're not alone, that everybody you know, in this room wants you to succeed. You're not by yourself. This is not like you're the only experience. There's a lot of people who have walked that walk that, that you've walked and um, we're cheering for you. I would say start simple and be consistent with what works for you. Be honest with yourself and don't lie to yourself. All heavy whipping cream has carbs. <laughs> <laughs> so counting it as zero is only lying to yourself and going to hurt you. 0. 0.41 grams per tablespoon. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just remember the difference between wants and needs. Your body needs fat and protein. You may want carbs, but you need fat and protein. So focus on what your body needs and not necessarily what you want. That's good. Thank you. Nobody said eat meat. And <laughs> I think that's implied. I don't want to take that away from the other people. Yeah. And, and shake your hand. I figured that was going to be. I think if you is. average everything we all said, that's what it comes down to. Yeah. Eat your meat. Eat oh, yeah. Meat. yeah. 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 Well, I guess so if you eat meat, you're doing something that makes you happy. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 You feel good about it. It's kind of like therapy. It's therapy. Yeah. It's, yeah. Yeah. it's fat and protein. It's going to help you keep moving. It helps you keep moving. Especially if you have to hunt your meat. Yeah. And if you eat meat, you'll never be alone you'll because as soon as the smell of bacon fills the air, you people will gather it. toward it. If yes. you make it, yes. they will come. Wow. <laughs> I think they should make a movie about that. I think they cooking, None of these people are even bacon bacon the breakfast to waste bacon. Even they the they people that they eat you when you eat bacon. They're going to come to your anger, but they're going to come to you. Have you <laughs> ever made a smoothie and then a bunch of people show up to your house? No, never <laughs> does that happen. But you make I mean, barbecue and like you can make a party just by adding barbecue. Yeah, yeah. my dog never came running when I made a smoothie. But, um, <laughs> the minute I opened that bacon pack up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What about bread? Oh, they yeah. ever come for bread? Not a time. No, no. Not. not even keto bread. The dog's like, whatever, I'm taking a nap. <laughs> <laughs> but you get we, the bacon out, and he's your best friend. We just made something. I don't remember what it was. We made something. The dog wouldn't eat it. The chickens wouldn't eat it. <laughs> you know something's wrong. Especially yeah. the chickens yeah. won't eat it. The yeah. chickens yeah. won't really eat it? Good. That's really bad. <laughs> <laughs> That's really bad. Tiny velociraptors. <laughs> or a <laughs> pig. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we'll need it. Picture those magical creatures that turn everything into bacon, right? That's right. right. Yeah. There's wisdom in the pigs because pigs make bacon. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Anything else, Mary? That's good. Okay. Thank Yay. you.